Hello, I'm Patrick Maloney, reporter with LFPress.com and the London Free Press. I've just returned from a lengthy, emotional, conflicted, fascinating, eye-popping, very interesting debate over the future of Uber, the e-hail giant in London. City Council voted 10-5 tonight to essentially take a step toward um, regulating Uber in the City of London, and of course that will have major implications for the city's traditional taxi industry. But rather than getting into the finer points of what City Council discussed tonight, I think what I'd rather talk about is the thing that I'm going to take away from it, which was the emotional reaction of one of the politicians who was left uh, almost in tears uh, as he voted to open the door to regulating Uber. That would be Councillor Mo Salee. He's in his first term from uh, East End Ward 3. Uh, Councillor Salee indicated uh, while he was speaking that many of the uh, taxi owners, who and a lot of them were in attendance at this debate, uh, uh, he recognizes them as fellow members of the local Muslim community. Uh, it's a very difficult thing to do because, of course, Uber is a, a significant threat to the traditional taxi industry. And if City Hall is going to start regulating them, that's going to make life easier for Uber, which will only make life more difficult for these traditional taxi owners. So I think if I'm going to take anything away from it, it would be just that. It was a, a lengthy debate. It was an emotional debate. And it's really going to affect people, uh, particularly in the taxi industry. Um, and again, Uber is still an unlicensed, illegal operation in the City of London. Uh, City Hall is not regulating it, but I would submit to you that this vote tonight by City Council is a significant step uh, toward making that happen. So for the London Free Press and LFPress.com, I'm Patrick Maloney.